It's estimated 17,000 lives are saved every year in the United States by seatbelts. And this woman is one of them. She was in a terrible car crash in which her car flipped over seven times and her seatbelt ended up cutting into her stomach like a sword. Oh, yeah. Now she's telling Inside Edition about her miraculous story of survival. It's a miracle Gina Arnold is alive. She was almost killed in a horrific car accident. Her seatbelt saved her life, but it also tore her body in half. It cut my whole abdominal wall like a sword. The 22-year-old was returning home from college, always a responsible driver. Gina fastened her seatbelt. That's the last thing I remember, the music playing on the radio. Gina lost control of her car. When I went to correct, I think I went too fast when I overcorrected. Her car flipped seven times, then hit a tree. Gina was rushed to the hospital in critical condition. Her mom, Sabina. You think it's a bad dream that all this is happening. This crash test footage shows how a body, even strapped in a seatbelt, can be tossed around during a violent rollover crash. Doctors performed a risky operation, sewing a large surgical mesh usually used to repair hernias across Gina's entire tummy to hold her organs in place. She has no abdominal muscles and wears this belt for protection. Now, two years after the accident, Gina can't lift anything heavier than 15 pounds. She still suffers from pain and swelling and needs help getting out of bed. At the Henry Ford Macomb Health Center in Richmond, Michigan, Gina undergoes very controlled physical therapy to strengthen her body and improve her balance. As far as motivation goes, Gina has always been asking for more and more and more. What else can I do? Can I do this at home? Gina is now doing things she never thought would be possible, and she's able to drive again. Despite everything she went through, she always buckles up. I'm extremely lucky to be alive.